Hello, and welcome to the next chapter in our ongoing series of tutorials that will help familiarize you and improve your skills with PaintShop Pro Photo X2 Ultimate. In today's short lesson, we're going to show you the basics of restoring an old damaged photograph. A popular task these days is to pull out all those old print photos from under the bed and digitize them for better maintenance and preservation. Oftentimes, these old photographs are fading and contain scratches, stains, fold marks, but all is not lost. From the one-step photo fix to the crop tool, the scratch remover, the fade correction, red eye remover, and color corrections, you'll be pleasantly surprised at the availability of tools and techniques in PaintShop Pro Photo X2 Ultimate to make your old photos look new again by either reducing or eliminating defects caused by aging and mishandling. Let's get started. First, I've opened up an image that could definitely benefit from some retouching. The first thing I'm going to do is apply a fade correction. As I've shown before, this can be done via the Learning Center or through the Adjust Color menu. This image is pretty faded, so I'm going to crank it up to about 70 like I have it here and say OK. And wow, what a huge difference that made. Let's undo it and redo it just so you can see the huge difference already. Fantastic. Now I'll apply a one-step photo fix from the Enhanced Photo drop-down list at the top of my window here. That's another good start. Then I'll do an adjustment under Adjust, Brightness and Contrast, Highlight Midtones and Shadows. This will bring down some of the really bright areas of the photo. So I'll make the adjustment to about a minus 25 or so on the highlight and click OK. So let's undo that and redo it so you can see our difference. Again, we're getting there. Now, unfortunately, I've introduced a lot of unwanted noise in our photo. Let's see if we can get rid of some of this too. I'll go to the Enhance drop-down again and choose One Step Noise Removal. Just like the One Step Photo Fix, this feature will be, can be manually applied through a dialog box. In this case, it's under Adjust Digital Camera Noise Removal in our menu. This has also helped tremendously. Again, let me undo and redo so you can see our differences. It's much, much smoother now. But what about all these creases? Can we get rid of these too? Let's see if we can. This horizontal scratch can be best fixed with a scratch remover tool. Simply adjust the width and drag along the distance of the scratch. The rectangle above and below is actually used to adjust the center rectangle. And that's looking pretty good. I'm going to apply this tool to as many scratches as I possibly can get it to work on. Then I'll use a soften tool to smooth out this area on the pants and the dress and some other areas in my photo. Now finally, I'll use the clone tool to eliminate some of these other imperfections. The clone tool is great for copying small sections of your image and using them to replace other areas with. But remember, this will take an exact copy of the area you choose as a source, so make sure they're as similar as possible in color and texture to the area you want to target. You can use the Alt key to interactively resize the selection handle by dragging it up and down like so. Then you right click on the source area and that will be applied to the new area. And finally, I'll up the color a little bit by adding some saturation. And there you have it. Let's look back at what it looked like before. So again, this is our after picture, and here's our before. That is a huge difference. Now, you can certainly spend more time using tools such as masking, selections, levels, and curves to make more precise adjustments. But for most of us, the tools I've shown you should do the trick. But again, all those other ones are also contained in PaintShop Pro Photo X2 Ultimate. Thanks again, and we'll see you in our next lesson.